So what is the difference between an easy bar and a straight bar, bro? People, they would ask me all the time. So look, when you're having an easy bar and you are curling it up, that means your wrist is like this when you bring it up. But look at my biceps. This is the easy bar, this is the straight bar. Easy bar, straight bar. So that means when I'm having a straight bar, my wrist is more rotated in, and the more I rotate it in, the more peak contraction I get on my biceps while I'm leaving still a lot of space when I'm using the easy bar. This is why you should use the easy bar in the straight bar, bro. So today I'm going to explain sky crushes to you for the triceps pro. There's two ways of doing it. You first you lay down, and then you can bring the weight down towards your head. And you can bring it down here. So you see the point of gravity is just changing. When I'm having it here, there's not much tension. When I'm having it here, I'm still having the tension on my tricep. And then I bring it down, and then I bring it up. Or I bring it down here towards my skull, right? And then I bring it up. That's what this exercise is called, skull crushes. So brother, for the natural races, there's this variation that you can do, but there's also this variation. This is more called like an upright row. Here you can take much heavier weights because the point of gravity is quite near to your body. While with this one, you bring it up here, the point of gravity is far from your body. This is why it's way harder. But you should do this movement and also this one so you can go more heavy, bro.